We've all been there. Someone obviously poor or homeless approaches you and asks for money. What do you do? Do you give money knowing it may be used on drugs or alcohol? Or do you say no or even ignore the person as you walk by? No one wants to be a sucker in these situations, but at the same time, Jesus' call to help the poor echoes in our hearts and minds. I get donations, basically from churches. Servant or sucker, wise and compassionate ways to help the poor helps viewers discern appropriate Christ-centered actions when it comes to addressing poverty on a personal or organizational level. Included are realities of poverty, such as the concepts of time, relationships, money, and values. A poverty tour, interviews with those who are homeless or poor, and with those who have helped and have been suckered, and steps viewers can take to be an effective servant without getting suckered. Too many times I've given them money and you don't know what they're going to do with it, whether they're going I to never know what their motives may be for asking for money. You can kind of see the people coming and hurry and get in your car. Says, yeah, I don't want to see people go hungry, but I also don't want to empower somebody to go and, you know, buy alcohol. And if I can avoid contact, then perhaps I can make them just go away. <laughs> I might be suckered, but, you know, I might actually be helping as well, so. How do we honor this call to help the poor but not to get suckered. Servant or Sucker, Wise and Compassionate Ways to Help the Poor is a five session DVD series offering tips on helping others in ways that enhance life for both the giver and the receiver. Under the guidance and expertise of the Reverend Beth Templeton, we explore poverty and learn practical methods of giving and how to employ effective outreach. Pulling oneself up by the bootstraps isn't as easy as it sounds. Get a job, right? But that requires good health, transportation, contacts in the community, education, and a place to live. Those aspects don't always fall into place without some guidance and help along the way. Servant or Sucker, Wise and Compassionate Ways to Help the Poor approaches the dilemma from all angles police officers who must serve and protect. There's just a lot of opportunities for them to, to avoid this type of lifestyle if they're willing to do it. The homeless who mingle with the masses and shrink into the shadows. It's like, hello, I'm human just like you are. Just because I'm out here doesn't make me any less than you. Business owners who come face to face with the need nearly every day. We have a policy that we don't allow them in the store if they're going to be asking other people for money inside the store. And individuals who are torn between assistance and avoidance. I don't give and it's a struggle because I feel like I should, but how do I know what they're going to do? Reverend Templeton challenges us to think through the cause and effect of poverty, society's response, and how as individuals we can affect change. Compassion is not judged by giving people exactly what they want. The word no is an equally caring and compassionate word. Let Reverend Templeton share with you how to successfully and compassionately respond to God's call to help without being suckered. Servant or Sucker, a unique resource from EcuFilm that informs and empowers.